Hello, today I'm going to give a quick introduction about Deye Hybrid Inverters. This is a top view of Deye Industry Park in Ningbo City, Zhejiang Province of China. This PPT includes three parts, specification comparison, comparison conclusions, and advantages analysis. This page tells main difference among major hybrid inverters brands on the market. The green part indicates the Deye hybrid inverter has advantages compared with other brands. The first green term is 120 April, which is maximum charging and discharging current of for on Deye 5 kW hybrid inverter. For others, most of them blow 100 April. With this feature, Deye 5 kW hybrid inverter has 5 kW output power in off-grid model. Signally, next atom is the startup voltage of 125 volts, which means the e hybrid inverter can start up at 125 volts of DC input voltage. Others are 150 volts. And thirdly, the e hybrid inverter supports 208 and 240 output voltage, suited to American grid standard, plus new atom is product weight. The e 5 kW hybrid inverter with only 20.5 kg, which means one person can carry it easily. From the previous page and other features, the main advantages as below maximum DC input power of 6,500 volts, the DC AC ratio up to 1.3, higher charging and discharging power of 120 April, um, 5,000 volts in off grid model. Independent grid and DC generator port, more convenient to connection. Built in DC generator control interface, including dry contactor output. The e hybrid inverter can use DC generator charging the battery and power the load. Ensure your system working within 7, seven days, 24 hours. Also, the e hybrid inverter adopts drop control technology to realize multiple inverters work in parallel model for single-phase system and three-phase system. Another highlight of for six time periods for battery charging and discharging to reduce your electricity bills. With colorful touch LCD, it tells energy flow information in real time, easy to read and operation. From this page, it tells more clearly and vivid about the e hybrid inverter features such as colorful touch LCD, DC AC ratio of 1.3, drop, con drop control, and so on. Uh, why do we design DC AC ratio of 1.3? With this feature, it is allowed users to connect more PV module when needed. Also, it is capable to compatible with double sided glass solar panel. So, users are allowed to choose various kinds of PV module. As we all know that under conditions such as the low irradiation, solar panel, attraction, dust, shadow, cable loose, and so on, there is about 15% energy loss for the solar system. In this situation, more solar panel connected will improve power generation efficiently. The hybrid inverters integrates, integrates an independent grid port, backup load port, and a diesel generator port. Plus, the DC generator also can be used as input or output port. When as the AC input, it can connect a micro inverter or string inverter. When as output, it can be used to power the load. We call it a smart load. Also, there is an on and off switch on the body. It will be very easy for end user to turn on and turn off the inverter. The e hybrid inverters completely compatible with DC generator. Generally speaking, almost all bronze hybrid inverter is allowed to connect the DC generator to power the load. We call it bypass function. However, 19% of storage inverters do not support use the DC generators to charge the battery. In other words, it only utilizes DC generator to power the load. Thanks to the e hybrid inverter has independent DC generator port and grid port, connecting DC generator becomes easy. Also, there is a dry contactor for controlling DC generator, switch on and off. 
it allows hybrid inverter to control diesel generator automatically. When using diesel generator to charge the battery, the hybrid inverter can turn off the diesel generator automatically when the battery SOC is up to 95%. Um, time of use. And there are time-independent electricity tariffs on many countries. Residents pay different price for their energy consumption at different times of day. Blue picture shows time of use tariffs applied in Australia. F for this situation, the hybrid inverter allows users to see the time for charging and discharging battery reduce energy cost. There are six different time periods in total for a whole day. So it means the um, and the user can charge the battery at a low price and use it when the price is high. The e hybrid inverter is able to connect the window tube as well. When connected the window tube, users need to sit on the LCD screen. Generally speaking, the window energy is more sufficient at night. However, and there was no sonar anymore in the evening. But if we use the e hybrid inverter, it, it can produce energy at night as well. What's more important, it supports one MPPT for um, PV module and uh, another one MPPT is for window turbo, window turbo energy. Here is the system diagram, diagram for, the, for connecting window turbo and the sonar panel together. AC couple model. It is used to retrofitting existing solar system to energy storage system, which is a capable to area with low FIT and a high energy price. And the Doe hybrid inverter working as a battery charge controller in the system. In this application, an external CT is needed to, de to detect the energy flow direction in the system. Also, there is another different AC couple model for the e hybrid inverter. In this system, we can see another string inverter or micro inverter connects to the hybrid inverter via the DC generator port. And the string inverter output of energy can be used to charge the battery or power the load. This solution is more flexible when uh, no matter the grid is present or cut off. An important technology is drop control for the hybrid inverters. In previous page, the microsystem isolating model, the hybrid inverter adopts drop control technology to establish and regulate system voltage and frequency. At the same time, the string inverter connected worker in PQ model. If needed, the hybrid inverter is capable of a cast off string inverter connection to maintain system stable. The red picture it tells how the system responds to the needs of external loads. And the hybrid inverter absorbs or releases power according to the system running states. The left diagram shows there is a nano relationship between system voltage and the frequency for additional generator and charge sticks. And the right diagram shows the basic principle of full drop control. The e hybrid inverter supports maximum 16 pieces in parallel. The blue diagram is for the single system application. Uh, as we can see, there is a three pieces hybrid inverter connected and one unit battery connected and all the output ports are connected together. The system diagram is for a single, system, single phase system. The master hybrid in, inverter measure and calculate voltage and, and the current and send it to slave hybrid inverter by communication cable. With this feature, it uh, ensures each hybrid has same output power in parallel system. As for three phase application, the system connection almost the same. The difference is one piece is hybrid inverter connector L1 and the other Two pieces hybrid inverter connector L2 and L3. Or the e hybrid inverter supports set parameters and the firmware update remotely via Wi Fi or GPIS data log. 
Generally speaking, it takes 20 minutes to complete the firmware update. With the help of a remotely platform, the engineers can help customers conveniently. Also, for users, they could check their solar station by mobile phone or PC at any time and anywhere. On the platform, system information is displayed completely and vivid. The right picture is from the smartphone app monitoring. This page shows the monitoring platform of a website interface of setting parameters for the hybrid inverters. The hybrid inverters has colorful touch LCD screen and buttons, providing comfortable user experience. On the LCD, you can see clearly system states such as PV information, battery information, grid information, and load information, and so on. When there is a fault occurs, the LCD will, will tell us fault code and the alarm indicator will on. Also, it will send a message to the platform if you connected a data log. The e hybrid inverters for series from 3.6 to 8 kW uh, with IP65 protection degree, which is, which is able to adapt to harsh environment. From the blue pictures, we can see product, the power inductor is placed separately from the main PCB with the glue field. It will greatly decrease in the heat and the noisy. The e hybrid inverter can adjust its output power by installing a CT or energy meter in order to realize zero export function. The e hybrid inverter also features high power density uh, with the light weight and the compact size. From below picture, we can see the e hybrid inverter 5 kW model is with only 20.5 kg and the 0, 0 0.0. 42 cubic meters, one person can carry it easily. Plus, other brown hybrid inverters are more bigger in size and weight. This is all. Thank you.